What's going on everybody? Today I have an HP Pavilion All-in-One model 24-B217C and I'm going to show you how to open the back cover on this. It's not as easy as you think. These are the four screws that hold the back stand on. Now this, those screws use a H2.5 tip. This little guy right here. Now, I had to use a combination of this little extension that came with my precision kit because if you look, a regular screwdriver, it, it, like I can, it, with, when I put the, the tip on, I can't fit it in here. It's too long. So I had to use this. Once I loosen the screws, but I use this to start a little flexible tip. So these screws are already loose because I've already done it once, but I strongly advise you to be super careful when you do this. So once you're in here, sorry, you're just going to kind of turn to the left and they are in there tight. So you really need to be careful. You don't want to strip the screws. All right, so there's number four. So I have all four of these screws out. So now I'm just gonna take this and lift up. There we go, that's out. Now believe me when I tell you that's the easy part. Now the hard part is gonna get yourself one of these spudgers. There's gonna be two, one here, and one here these are little rubber covers there's a screw behind them but you're not going to actually take the screw out so i'm going to pry this out here actually i'll use my little screwdriver for that there's one And there's two. So now you could see here and over here, there's two screws. Now what these actually do is kind of get you started to pop the cover off. So you put your screwdriver in here and you turn and as you turn, let's move this back so you can see, it kind of pops the cover off. Now the cover's already off for me. All this is going to do is pop this area off a little bit and pop the other area off. There's no other screws you have to remove. Do not try overturning this. That would not be good. You risk damaging something or worse, bending the screen in the front and cracking something. So now all you have to do, you need to take your spudger tool and go along the edge all around you need to be super careful when you do this and make sure that you're actually putting the spudger tool underneath and up don't try to push from the bottom if that makes sense you want to pry from up go inside and pry kind of downward but very careful and make sure the screen is on something like this like a towel or something because you really got to be careful not to damage the screen so this one I've already done, so I'll show you. Now, the back is going to come off, but pull from the from the, the back here away from you because there is, as you can see, a cable. This cable is just connected to the CD-ROM drive. We'll just pull it to disconnect it. There we go. We'll set that aside. Now we could take this cover and we could set the cover aside. And now you have access to the back inside of the machine. 
Now from here, you have access to the hard drive, the fan. Now some of you might be asking, how do I access the RAM? How do I access the CPU? Well, let me show you. This whole cover right here comes off. It looks more intimidating than it is. You don't need to worry about these black screws at all. There's actually just five screws. Okay, and we're going to go through it, and we're going to remove them right now. So there's one here. One right here. That's two. There's one on the side here. That's three. That's four. And number five. Now with all five screws, it kind of just tilts up and out to the left. See that? A lot of you probably like, oh, that's a lot simpler. And then look at that. The RAM, the CPU is underneath the heat sink. There's screws right here. And screws for the GPU. Fans right here. You have access to everything now, even the battery if you need to change the battery. That's it. And then you just put it all back together like you took it apart and you're good to go. So I hope this helps somebody out there who's trying to figure out how to access the back panel of this model. Thank you and have a good day.